All right, guys, what is going on? Mystic here, back with more Legend of Zelda Ocarina. Oh, not Ocarina. Ah, got me again. Majora's Mask. My bad. Yeah, Majora's Mask. Last time we left off, we uh, came here to Great Bay after getting this stone mask that'll help us at the uh, Pirate's Hideout. Hideout, the uh, girl do Pirate Hideout. And uh, when we came here to Great Bay, we seen a Zora that was trapped in a that was up in the uh, middle of the ocean here and unfortunately something bad happened with the water where it's to where uh, he couldn't survive because of the temperature and uh, yeah when we brought him to shore he, he began walking slowly on the shore and then he just collapsed on the ground and it happens to be uh, uh, Mika Mika or Miku I don't, know, I don't know how you pronounce his name because it's spelled M-I-K-A-U. And he just collapsed in the sand. So, yeah, basically what we need to do is uh, go to the pirate's place at his request and uh, find these eggs for this, um, this Zora girl singer and a group called the Indigo Go. So, yeah, we're going to do that. But first, we're going to check this side first and see what's going on over here. So, yeah. Take that, you stupid thing. I forgot what they're called. Well, um, yeah. Uh, over there, that way. Let's see. If it will let me. Okay, over there, there's the Great Fairy's Place. For uh, the temple that we're going to be doing for the ocean. And, uh, yeah. We're, gonna, we're not... I don't know if we can uh, go there yet. Because I think you need an item to go there. Like the hook shot. So yeah. And we're going to get that pretty soon. But not right now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use my bombs here to see what's under this rock. If there's a hole or anything. I think there's a hole. Is it? Oh yeah. There is a hole right here. Uh, but it looks like nothing but rupees and... Uh, couple little deku plants to uh, get some deku uh, sticks and seeds or, or not deku uh, De deku nuts the ones that stun you stun your enemies I don't know I'm kind of tired you know I just woke up <laughs> see look you're not gonna be able to make it there just by trying to jump over there see there's the great fairies place right there for uh, the temple that we're gonna be doing for the for the ocean area and I will say that uh, these temples here the uh, oh dang it the uh, what's the name the temple I mean the, the straight fairies are gonna be a lot harder to get so yeah and I still haven't went back to uh, the woodfall temple to uh, get the fairy there because it's invisible so yeah Basically, what I'm going to do is probably probably go back sometime and try to get it by just shooting arrows in random spots. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Where's Epona? Okay, there she is. Yeah, we're going to see what's going on over here. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think you can get another empty bottle here, if I'm not mistaken. What the heck? I didn't even hear your opponent go, yeah! <laughs> I'm just saying. But, uh, right here, hold on, let's see. Fall, fall head waters, beaver's home, beware of swift currents. Oh yeah, right. It, there's those fish right there, and yeah, uh, a like like. Uh, the only way you're gonna be able to get down there is by using the uh, Zora mask from uh, Miku, and you're basically gonna have to fight them all. So uh, here's the stuff you can dive.
So what we're gonna do is get rid of them. These fish too. Night of the first day, 60 hours remain. Oh shit, get off me. Okay, we got a piece, you give us a piece of heart and we're gonna destroy that fish there. Uh, they're supposed to be, I forgot how we get here to this place. All right, I just seen that fish pop up. I don't know if that's the same one that I killed and they just like respawn. But uh, yeah, we're trying to find the opening to uh, the beaver's place. Cause yeah, there's supposed to be these beavers. And you're supposed to like get an empty bottle from them. So that'll make us have two, is, what, is that a total of two empty bottles? I forgot how you enter. Oh, I'm so silly, guys. I remember how we entered. Now we're gonna need the hook shot because you're gonna have to go. You'll see. I'll show you. I'll show you. Cause look, the way you're gonna have to uh, get to them. Is by see the trees up there. You're gonna have to use a hook shot, and we're not gonna get the hook shot until we go to the pirate's place and stuff and start uh, finding those eggs. So we're, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna. Oh my goodness. We're gonna find the pirate place, and then uh, yeah, from then from there, we're just gonna try to get the eggs and uh, you know. Uh, try to get the hook shot. Why the like likes look so big though? Like, like when I when I was playing on my own time, they like scared the mess out of me because like I was like, why are they so big? Cause when you play Ocarina of Time, they're not so big. Yeah, I, I'm just kind of going around to, to so I can try to kill them. Yeah, kill them. Take it. That one's dead. Oh, I know why. Because the night hasn't started yet. That's probably why. Yeah, give me some of them rupees. I'll be happy. I'm uh, sorry if I'm wasting you guys' time. Uh, I will get to the pirate place as soon as I collect these rupees from these like likes that I just killed. But uh, all of you that are patient, thank you very much. Now to get to the uh, pirate place, we're gonna go back to this this side over here, and uh, oh man, I like to go in that house right there and uh, try to kill all the gold skulls because I, if I'm not mistaken, you get a mask or an extra bottle. No, no, not even that. You get the giant's wallet actually. My bad. You get the giant's wallet from that from that uh, spot, but. Uh, what I'm, okay, what we're gonna do is go to uh, the pirate's hideout so that we may rescue the eggs for uh, that Zora singer. Oh, another like, like, take it. Take the bomb. Yeah. See, look how big it is. Why is it so big? I could destroy it faster with my gilded sword. Yeah, 
like there is no reason why they should be so big but uh, if I'm not mistaken you need to turn into uh, yeah you need to uh, use the Zora mask and turn into uh, Miku and uh, yeah See, look, you can swim with him. Now, is it over here or what? It's supposed to be around here somewhere, if I'm not mistaken. Right here. Here it, get, here it goes, right here. There it go, guys. Here's the opening to the... Uh, the Gerdu Pirate Entrance. See that? Pirate's Fortress. Now, like I said, I recommend you getting the stone mask because, like, you'll blend into the environment. And, uh, none of the Gerdu girls will really see you. So, yeah. I hope I'm not spoiling anything. I like to think I'm not because this game came out in, what, year 2000, I believe? Like two, like two years after Majora's Mask. See, look, that pirate girl cannot see me. If I jump on the boat, right there, she won't notice. But, have if I get too close and like touch her, she'll notice. Look at this. I'm on the boat. So basically, what you need to do is get all the way over to the left side to uh, get further in this place. See, none of them notice me because I have the stone mask on. Now, if I did, they'd probably notice me. I'm not sure. But we're just going to keep the stone mask on. So, yeah. Which is funny. This weird, ugly looking mask and they don't even notice it. I like it. So, yeah, you're going to come right here. Just going to walk up here. And, uh, yeah. I don't know why my legs and stuff are all shaky, but, uh, okay, what we're going to do is turn into the Gorn real quick, Gorn Link as Darmani, and we're going to curl up and ground pound this. Be quickly now. Yeah, now you want to enter through there as the uh, Zora. I'm not sure if it closes up or not, but you, if, if it does, you need to hurry up. And yes, there are some of the fish down here, so be careful. Oh, man, that fish came out of nowhere. Almost scared me. So, yeah, here we are. Grab this, pull it back. Let's go ahead and surface. Let me kick this up. You know, I don't, I don't know if I ever even kicked this treasure chest before. Let's see. trying to figure out what to do next yeah like I said I, I it's been a while since I've been at this part I'm trying to figure out what to do exactly but I don't remember hold up I, I guess we can go ahead and push this 
Looks like you'd have to go through there and pull it back somehow. Yeah, I'm gonna push this up, actually. Oh, wait, I actually did this right. I should have kept that pulled back right there. Yeah, let's, yeah, I'm gonna go back and pull that. Yeah, so using uh, Miku works as your iron boots, basically since they're not in this game, which is, I think is I think is actually cool. But I do kind of miss. I mean, you got to run underwater, but this one you get to run much faster underwater just because you're a Zora, and it's cool. And, oh yeah, and this basically replaces your boomerangs. See that? But you get two. Cause I don't know. I don't know if you actually get the boomerang in this game or not. I don't. I don't think you do. Might have to I might I might have to uh, research up on it and check it out. But yeah, you're gonna. Yeah, yeah, here we go. You're gonna come through here. Watch out, fishy. So I made a mistake right there. Okay. Alright, so I remember these things like not rolling. Now you can go ahead and surface right here. And you'll be coming through this door. But uh, I think I'm going to put the stone mask on just to be safe. So, yeah. <laughs> 